just like that we live man um, i learned today how much water i can drink in succession to where i get to the point to where it absolutely feels terrible 10 bottles of water puts me in a state that i really do not enjoy i always tell people if you enjoy just like downing water you don't drink enough water anybody that tries to tell me that they like drinking water is absolutely lying because if you drink the adequate amount that you're actually supposed to have on a day-to-day -day basis there's no way that you love that dude because literally it is its own way of being a toilet you know what i'm saying it's like its own version of a toilet if you kind of think about that but yeah man shout out to everybody in the building you already know exactly what it is man um we're doing it live and we're live doing it man um a lot of people they sit around they have absolutely nothing going on but we always keep ourselves busy, homie. You know what I'm saying? We're so busy to the point to where we get dizzy, man. And that's just the way that it's supposed to go. The keishas are going to sit around and they're going to wonder, where is he? But guess what? We are making progress. Your whereabouts shouldn't necessarily be something that they care about. But since they have nothing in their lives, all they can do is tune into your lives. You know what I'm saying? Uh, get that key up out of my comment section. By the way, Kane, I know you might be occupied right now. So I'm not expecting you to keep up with the frequency. I have absolutely no problem just pressing the button. As is, I know that this time of night is not typical for my live streams, but we're switching it up, you know what I'm saying? So, guess what? You gotta have some adaptability to be able to catch my shows, otherwise you won't be in the show. Actually, none of you will be in the show, but you mean, you know what I mean, like in the comment section, man. So, shout out to all of the Keishas, shout out to all of the moderators. Let me get this Keisha up out of the comment section. They're sitting around writing and typing. Instead of actually doing something and putting boots on the ground and helping and, you know, being of use to the people out there, they just wanna sit around in the comment section and say this and say that, you know what I'm saying? to get this up out of here too man we're gonna keep getting the quiches up out of the comment section oh now i got stun in the building yeah stun him what it is man i said that i'm gonna start um do a different time lies maybe that will be easier for you to join you know what i'm saying i'm just trying to make it as optimal as possible um revolving around my schedule so yeah man i'm absolutely upset that raul rojas jr he's not even gonna be fighting this weekend dude i really wanted to see him do it last week but i guess you know if it's not supposed to happen it won't happen you know what i'm saying so with that being said, man, we're finna have a great episode. We're finna do it the way it's supposed to be done, homie. You know what I'm saying? And I am overly hydrated. I didn't even think that that was a reality. I thought you could just keep drinking more and more water until you get tired of it. No, you will get sick of it. <laughs> Literally and physically. So yeah, man, shout out to everybody. You know, it's the evening for you. Uh, some of you might be the morning, depending upon what country you're watching from. But guess what? You still have time within the day. So you should use your time that you currently possess. The quiches are possessed. You possess time. You have a gift. Understand that the present is a gift in of it itself and you should use it efficiently. You know what I'm saying? Only put yourself around energy where it's like where you resonate with. Um, if you're pouring love and energy and attention into people that don't reciprocate it, you don't even need it because you will always feel drained. You will always feel extended to people that don't even deserve you, homie. You are an additive in many people's lives, but guess what? You should also subtract certain people from your life. That's just the way that it goes. People that think that they have a lot of friends, they have a lot of snakes that they actually haven't even realized because they're not paying attention. You know what I'm saying, Caleb? That's the reason why we do what we do strong, where we belong, you know? You have to have adaptability. Some days you might post a picture and it'll get one like. The next day it might get negative five. Love the positivity. I appreciate it. We're just sitting around giving good game, uh, keeping the quiches entertained, you know, having a whole lot of fun and making sure we get it done, man. People will sit around and watch everything you do, whether it's via the internet or in real life, and just be envious, just be jealous. Because when you carry a confidence that is granted from actual discipline and actually you know doing things they get mad about that because they will not dare to be great the only time that they feel any sort of sense i mean not even sense the any time that they feel a semblance of strength is when they're surrounded by people i mean look at it you'll have people that won't go to the mall to shop unless they, unless they got five or six people with them they won't go to the barber if they don't have their homeboy to get a haircut too because they're too anxious they can't even communicate with the barber that's the reason why they can't they can't communicate with us what to do curly you know what time it is yeah 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 man i tell people all the time like when you feel like you're missing out understand that someone else wants what you have growing up you know i had extremely curly hair and i really didn't like it because at the time 2009 justin bieber was relatively possible for his bowl cut and it was like get that key ship out of my comment section i really wanted it so bad but i couldn't get it i wasn't capable so i strongly disliked my curls when everybody that had straight hair wish they had curls so whatever you swear that you don't want somebody else will so be grateful for what you have rather than complaining about what is not attainable currently you know and that's like the number one negative about social media. People see it as a comparison tool. So they will feel like they're missing out. Oh, I got all of my moderators in the building. What's up, Sky? Yeah, feeling so fly, I could touch the sky. Yeah, we're doing a different live, homie. You know what I'm saying? You got to stay away from the Keishas because they're more like Frieza. We're more like Vegeta. You got to stay away from the Keishas because they are more like Frieza and we are like Vegeta, homie. 
I sit back and I say to myself, people be so caught up. You know how many people haven't washed the dishes, brushed their teeth, or put any deodorant on, but they made sure that they watched the Ryan Garcia, Devin Haney press conference? These are the types of levels of order that they have within their day. And make sure each and every single one of you send me a message immediately on TikTok, because as this episode is over, I will be sending everybody my Snapchat. That is the best way to talk and to stay up to date with the content, whether it be the music, the game, the merch, whatever the case may be. I do what I do. I just be blind man shuffling, doing what I want over there, doing what I want over here. When you have control of your life and what you would like to do, dude, it's absolutely so amazing. A lot of the things that people tell you you can't do, that's what they think. What they think has nothing to do with your reality because they don't live your life like that Rihanna and T.I. song. They don't live your life. Stop being so materialistic. Stop being so statistical, um, statistically driven because you'll sit around and you'll look at numbers and you'll be like, man, they're not this anymore. Dude, it's better to keep going on even if you're statistics have a drop off rather than to do nothing at all that's what a lot of people have to understand we are all in our own race of life and it's like homie if you're taking one step in this forward direction it doesn't matter about the person who did 10 or 15 or 20 what you're doing is what you're doing and what they're not doing is what they're not doing what they like is what they like what you like is what you like what you do is what you do what they don't and you know to carry on with that that's the type of mentality that you have to have get that key ship out of my comment section we got a full grown man sitting around he's probably on lunchtime at mcdonald's commenting things like that in my comment section I keep on trying to tell you whether the sun just came up the quiche is there whether the sun just went down the quiche is there From dusk to dawn the quiche will always Be in attendance via social media, but when they see you in real life They'll just say absolutely nothing and act like they don't see you But they're staring at you you ever look in your peripherals and you just see somebody eyeing you That's what the quiches be doing homie. They stare at you because they wish the success you had they could share with you Yeah, 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 no, they stare at you because the success that you have they wish they could share with you So since they can't be a part of it, they want to talk down on it. Yeah, they just want to get in yeah, yeah, yeah. Hating from the other side. You can't even get in. Look at me now. Hey, I'm getting paper. I do what I do, man. You know what I'm saying? You have to understand your vehicle. You have to be driven. You have to have drive. Otherwise, you will not get to your destination. Hello, early stream tonight. Yeah, Jay, I said I'm going to switch it up. You know what I'm saying? We're going to do it in different in many different ways. Uh, tonight, I'm a lot more cohesive than yesterday. That Red Bull really had me all over the place. But guess what, homie? We're doing it the way it's supposed to be done. We're having a whole lot of fun. Uh, yeah. So shout out to everybody that's in attendance, homie. You know, I'm giving you some information that you could turn into energy that will be very, very optimal for what you have to do, what you don't need to do, who you need to be around, who you don't need to be around, homie. If people are constantly coming to you, telling you what someone else said, understand that that person that said whatever is comfortable gossiping to your friend. So you have to tell yourself, is that really your friend? If people are coming around you and all they can talk is about negative propaganda going on in the media, are they miserable people? These are questions you have to ask yourself. You see, we're living in a day and an age where people question everybody and everything else, but they never even question themselves, homie. They never do that. And if they did, if they wrote it down on paper, whether it be a notebook or even internally, they would understand who they need to be around. All company is not good company. It's not about thinking that you're better than anyone else, but it's understanding what you must tolerate and having standards. It's about what you must tolerate and having standards. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to Jay for the rose. But make sure you all keep double tapping the screen, man. Um, You know, we're doing what we're doing. We're doing it great, man. The Keishas can't relate. All they want to do is sit back and be mad. But bro, you should be happy about life. There are a lot of people that are no longer living. So while you're continuing to live, don't worry about the people who are going live and showing this and showing that. All that stuff is superficial. And the reason that they post it is to impress you. So you're living in a world where you're trying to chase other people's success and they're trying to chase your acceptance. It's an unhealthy transaction and they're not compatible. You know what I'm saying? There's no return on investment in that. It's okay to be motivated and inspired. I'm inspired by a lot of people. I'm motivated by a lot of people. But at the end of the day, who I seek to be like is the best version of myself, which guess what? That's Christ-like, homie. Literally. You know what I'm saying? So that's what you have to understand. So what if they got on those Jordans? If you walk in Walmart and you see a pair of shoes that you like, quit worrying about the logo. The person who owns the logo don't even know you. He don't even know you, never gave you, you know, an affiliate link. He didn't do anything for you, but you're investing all of your hard earned money in superficial things just to impress people that if you weren't wearing it, wouldn't be impressed. So if what you have impresses people, they don't care about who you are. And that's what you have to understand. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If what you wear impresses people, that means that they don't really regard who you are. It's about what you have and who you know. And these are the things that are always going to define a situationship and not a relationship. These are the things that are always going to define a situationship and not a relationship. You should aspire to be great. And if you have people who are being dormant in life, you should encourage them. But if they want to stay down there, homie, you can't stay at the bottom of the mountain forever. So guess what? They got to be left there. Sometimes to get right, some people got to get left, homie. Yeah, 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 no. Sometimes to get right, some people got to get left. 
Y'all think just because everybody has their eyes open and they're walking around that they're not sleeping on you? Dude, they're daydreaming. Skywalking on you haters. Come on, man. I'm just giving you some game. You know what I'm saying? So with that being said, I appreciate all of you for your support. I'm getting ready to end this episode. And with that being said, get that Keisha up out of here, man. Oh, wait. Oh, yo, no, no, that ain't Keisha. That ain't Keisha. My bad. I read that too fast. If you guys do get him out of here, bring him back. Bring him back. Bring him back. I read that way too fast. That's my bad. So with that being said, man, we're going to keep doing what we do. We're getting ready to take care of the next goal. So make sure each and every single one of you send me a message immediately on TikTok so I can send all of you my Snapchat. That's the best way to talk and to stay up to date with the content. You will get double the episodes tomorrow. But until tomorrow, we're going to take care of what we need to today. So with that being said, peace.